This operation has to be done only the first time. Type developer.apple.com in your browser navigation bar. Choose the option iOS Device Center. The first time you need to register. Select Get Started. To go through this part you need an Apple ID, which you may have if you use iTunes or an iPhone. Click on Create an Apple ID to create a new one. In this tutorial we use an existing account. In this section you have to insert your Apple ID and password. Click on Sign In. Select iOS Provisioning Portal from the menu on the right. At this point, select Certificate on the left side of the screen. In this section, you can choose among four tabs. We only need to work on the first two, Development and Distribution. In both cases, you'll be required to insert a certificate previously downloaded from Apps Builder. Using a development certificate, you can develop and test apps on specific devices that you can select from this section. If you want to publish your app on the store, you'll need a distribution certificate. Click on Request Certificate. At this point, you click on Choose Document to upload your certificate. Click on Submit. Repeat the sequence in the section Distribution. Then click again on Request Certificate. Choose a document to upload your certificate. Confirm the operation clicking on Submit. You can now select if you want to use your app on all Apple mobile devices or only on selected ones from the Devices section. Creation of the Application Certificate The sequence has to be done every time you create and publish an app. Select App IDs on the left part of the screen. To create a new app, click on New App ID. Insert a description. Type com.appsbuilderidapp.appsbuilder in the field bundle identifier. ID app is your apps identifier released by Apps Builder. Click on Submit. Click again on Apps ID on the left part of the screen. Click Configure. Here you can enable push notifications for your app. If you want to enable push notifications, click Configure. Click Continue in the pop-up window that will come up. Upload your certificates to require authorization. Click on Generate. Download your certificate for push notifications. You can now configure the second step. Click on Configure and repeat the previous operations. Select the certificate file. Click on Generate. Download this last certificate. At this point, select Provisioning on the left side of the screen. In this phase, you need to create a new profile. 
This operation has to be repeated for both tabs, Development and Distribution. Click on New Profile. Insert Profile Name. Use the certificate given. Select your app's ID. Click on Submit. Repeat the operations for the tab distribution. Click on New Profile. The App Store allows to specify that the application will be published on the Apple App Store. Insert a profile name. Select your app ID. Click on Submit. At this point, your certificate is under evaluation. When you terminate the process, click Download. Your app is now ready to be uploaded on the Apple Store.